I'm Shuntaro Takeda, Associate Professor of Applied Physics at the University of Tokyo. I received my PhD in Applied Physics in 2014, and in 2019, I became an Associate Professor and started my own research group. In our lab, we explore new ways to perform complex and high-speed computation. So the goal is to create what is known as a quantum computer. We experience the benefits of computers every day, but there are many problems uh, that current supercomputers will never be able to solve on realistic timescales. Quantum computers can outperform traditional computers in many kinds of tasks, material design, optimization of financial or logistical problems, and artificial intelligence, and so on. To perform functions, quantum computers control waves and particles at the smallest known scales. Some are based on atoms, some are based on electrons. In our designs, we use light to represent information. So as well as electric components you may find in classical computers, we also use optical components such as lenses, mirrors, and crystals. An optical quantum computer has unique advantages, for example, it works without vacuum or cooling systems. Recently, we discovered a new design to perform quantum computation with an optical circuit arranged in a special loop structure. Uh, the apparatus is small enough to fit on a desk. Eventually, we can make such an optical circuit on a small chip. Uh, the main challenge in realizing any kind of a quantum computer is trying to overcome the extreme fragility of quantum particles. We have to protect quantum particles from disturbance while allowing some degree of control. Rather than an inevitable part of quantum computation, and we continue to find ways to efficiently collect for them. We have to optimize position and angles of many hundreds of mirrors. So if money were no object, I'd like to bring in many more researchers, a diverse range of people with a diverse range of ideas. We believe that the optical quantum computer has a very great potential. Quantum mechanics is a wondrous thing, and engineering is extremely creative. To work in this field is to combine both of these for the enjoyment of a beautiful endeavor.